I'd like to welcome everybody to this debate. The, um, this House believes that uh, Obama should have been re-elected. Um, uh, our first speaker for the proposition is Omar. Thank you. <clears throat> My name is Omar Strada and I'm on the proposition. And we are saying that we, we think that uh, Obama, Barack Obama should, should have been elected. It should be elected for this to be the president of uh, America. Um, well, he has done a number of good things for for uh, America and society, such as killing killing Osama bin Laden, uh, like kept telling U.S. forces to kill Osama bin Laden, and he also ended the DADT, which is basically uh, an acronym for don't don't ask, don't tell, which is a which is a which is a policy saying that. Um, or any no homosexuals are allowed to join the army, and then he ended this policy, which is which basically like it's showing um, equal rights, and uh, he also ended the war in Iraq, which is causing like turmoil for for um, the America and the Iraqi the Iraqis over there, and, and also he's um, he was also trying to improve the environment, so like basically this. You, you're basically saying, if you buy a hybrid car, you 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 get to spend less money for but pay for that car, basically. So it's like encouraging to be to be environmental. So yeah, um, that's what I'm not in. Barack Obama is a good president, and he should be elected. So thank you. 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 Um, I believe that um, 
President Barack Obama should have stayed president because he was one of the greatest of the United States I've ever had. Since um, Abraham yeah, Lincoln, he, he is the greatest. Um, he's done many things for the country, like um, sent And then revolt the Arab war. Barack Obama is one of the greatest. He is, he has helped many lives in his time being president in four years he has. So that's why he should and st stay president. Fill his duties that he did because he did not finish um, the promises that he made. The promises that he made to the United Kingdom. So they should give him the chance as he did the first time to fill the debts that he made. Uh, I'd like to welcome our second speaker for the opposition. Um, hello, I'm Soren, and I'm going to be saying um, about Obama's reckless spending. Obama's reckless spending has added more to the national debt than um, more U.S. presidents combined. He, um, he spent roughly around $6 trillion alone in his first term of office. By doing this, he's making his people suffer and hate him more. It's affecting his people, the environment and the economy. He's pushing everyone away by spending their money on unnecessary things when it could be going towards something the country actually needs. 